Hey guys, this is Good One Boy here, and I'm gonna be showing you how to get the Android Market or the Google Play Market now um, for the rooted Kindle Fire. So first, what you're gonna want to do is ha obviously have your Kindle Fire rooted, and after you root it, you're supposed to have the Super User app. So yeah, and then you go download. Root Explorer and the Android Market Files APK, which are going to be in the description. So let's go ahead and start. Oh, before that, you go into, to download those files, you go into Settings, More, and then you go, um, Wireless Network, no, sorry, Device, and then Allow, Installation of applications from unknown sources, click on so you can actually download those. So you go into Root Explorer and you're gonna be in this page, and then go in SD card, then go into download and find the file. Which is gonna look like this. Like that. So you click you hold that file and click extract all. And then go go to extracted. Um if this gets out of fo focus, I'm sorry. Is that I don't have my camera, I'm recording with an iPhone. So click Kindle Fire Android Market. Then click, you're supposed to have these three. Get this one, Google Services Framework, and click install. Mine's going to say replace application because I already have it, so. And then install down here. There we go. Application installed, click done. After that, you're going to get this again. Hold down Market APK. And click Move. Then, you're going to go back, back, back. One more time. Then, go into System. Then, App. And, right here, it's supposed to say... Mount as RW. Um, RW means read write. So you go in and then go in, go, sorry, click paste. Sorry, paste. And then mine says it already exists. Just click OK. And then it will be. Inside there, go look for it. There it is. And then hold it. Permissions. Change this. It's supposed to look like this. When you get it, just turn off this one, this one, that one. And then turn on that one and that one. So you'll have something like this. The rest are going to be blank. Just click OK. And then... Click the market APK. Click install. Mine's gonna say that I already have it, so if I wanna replace it, okay. And then click install. I don't know if you can see it very well. Then you're gonna click done. Let's go home and turn it off. I'm sorry, since I'm in the iPhone, I can't turn it off and on again, so I'm going to have to turn it on while recording. So I'm just turning it on. As you can see, that's the root. I'm going to show you in this old Android phone I have.
Um, here we go. Sorry. I'm going to show you the new market, which is called Google Play something. <laughs> so that's exactly the one you're going to have. Sorry. Let's go there. Then let's go back. And that's how it comes out. Like that. Yeah, so it's ads. I just clicked Evernote, I think. Yeah, I did. So click me. And it says download right there. Just like the old one. So I'm just showing you the Android market. So you'll see that it's exactly the same in the Kindle Fire, which should be turning on like right now. Let's see. Sorry, I'm taking so long. If I could stop the video and put it back, I would. But it won't let me. So let's do this. Also, in the actual marketplace, you'll see that it says, okay, the Kindle turned on, but it's, it has the Google sign there instead of the market so here I open this and go to my normal launcher and then go back into root explorer and go into SD card and then go to download no sorry instead of download you go down find either extracted which is right there most people don't get this in there the first time so I'm just gonna take you to the other one or speed software which that's where I'm gonna go and then click extracted supposed to be there the what no see mine aren't there mine are in extracted let me see yeah, Kindle Fire Android Market. It'll be in either one of those. So I'll go inside that one. And you have these two. And you will now install marketopener.apk. Okay. Install. Application install. Click done. Go home. And then. Oh, let me see this. You have the Android market right there. You open it. And it'll ask you for your Google account and you do it and but mine's already there. As you can see it has the same things. It actually works. Um I downloaded some games like Temple Run. Like for example um Temple Run um that's like drag racing but in motorcycles. I I downloaded some a lot of games from there that you can't find on the regular market. So if you like this video, please subscribe. Go to my website. I'll have a link in the description. Comment and like. See you guys.